Hey everybody, happy Friday. It's uh, Mountain Mama from Apadana, uh, Randy Hitchcock. I'm the executive director of this awesome nonprofit here with your June Apadana update. So looking at my notes here, don't mind me. I just wanna start off with a sponsor thank you. We had a cash uh, sponsorship for our Adventure on Tap program and that came from the Screening Room AV. And these guys are home theater installers and they installed an 11 foot screen as well as surround sound in the building that we're um, co-working out of. And we get to use their setup for our Adventure on Tap every month. So it's a great screen for videos and photography. Um, and our speakers, uh, I think, kind of feel, you know, like they're being honored by being allowed to use this amazing setup for their um, presentation. And uh, we'll talk about Adventure on Tap coming up this month in just a minute. But thank you to Screening Room, AV, and John, and Joel, and Dave, I think is his name. Um, and they're also in our building, so thank you guys for the support. Another great in-kind sponsorship we just had today. I reached out on Facebook. I asked for desperate need of help. Um, I feel like I'm two weeks behind on everything, on all this planning. So I remembered at the last minute, uh, tomorrow we have an all-day uh, paddleboarding activity at Prospect Lake and I have SUP staff this year. I have paddleboarding staff dedicated to this program which is a first for Apadana. So I have to take care of them <laughs> and not that I don't take care of my volunteers but I got to take care of my staff too because they're out there for about six to eight hours in the hot sun uh, dealing with hundreds maybe thousands of people um, on our paddle boards so uh, Blue Moon Entertainment stepped up with a in-kind donation of drinks and snacks and all this stuff so I just want to thank them um, for taking care of our paddleboarding staff tomorrow. Okay, moving on to another great opportunity for us. We were recently given a $5,000 grant from Colorado Springs Health Foundation, so a big thank you to them as well. Uh, that helps with our, uh, goes to general operating funds right now, and then as we progress farther into the year, we're gonna look to apply for program-specific funding as well. So thanks again to Kari and Jamie over there at Colorado Springs Health Foundation. Okay, getting into the events. Uh, tomorrow, June 1st, is Get Outdoors Day, and it's kind of a statewide activity, but um, the local activity is taking place at Prospect Lake from nine to three. The first 1,000 children in line get a free fishing pole. So um, that's awesome. It, I think there's also a free fishing day this weekend as well. So get in line early. Um, I'd suggest like 8.15. Uh, we'll be there at 7.30 getting our paddle boards ready for you at nine. Um, and again, we're there all day, nine to three. So come and see us. We'll be by the YMCA Beach House down towards the south and west side of the lake. Um, so again, Prospect Lake, uh, nine to three, get outdoors day. Uh, after that, uh, next week is uh, the beginning of our Generation Wild paddle, paddle boarding class. Uh, this is a grant that we are a part of with many other program providers, and we provide paddle boarding for kids uh, sixth through eighth grade and then ninth through twelfth grade. Uh, next week is sixth through eighth grade, and the spots are almost filled. So if you want to get your kids in next week, do it immediately. Uh, it's twenty dollars for three days on the lake. Uh, we do have scholarships available, so um, always feel free to contact us with questions either by phone or email or comment on this post and um, I'll help you out. Uh, that's a lot of fun. That's four different weeks we're doing uh, paddle boarding with the youth in our community. Okay, June is Colorado Bike Month, if you didn't know that. We're a month later than the entire nation. May is Bike Month for the nation, and we do that specifically because of the weather. Um, it makes sense in Colorado, we would have been pedaling in a lot of snow in May. So June is Bike Month, and uh, we have tons of great uh, events going on. Um, not only our pedal party every Wednesday evening from six to seven at Oscar Blues, but we are also doing a bike to work day breakfast and that's gonna be in the next desk building um, that we're a co-working part of uh, at 525 North Cascade. So you can come find us, it's early in the morning. Um, it's kind of before I like to get up, but it's 6.30 a.m. to 9 a.m. at the next desk and uh, we'll be outside, hopefully, fingers crossed, it's nice weather. We'll be flipping pancakes, we'll have fresh fruit, yogurt, um, usually our 
station is voted as one of the best locations. So yeah, come on out and enjoy a free breakfast on Bike to Work Day. That is June 26th, um, again, early that morning. We'll have some prizes from uh, the businesses in that uh, building. So um, moving on. First in Maine, we are so excited to be partnering with First in Maine out on Powers again this year to help them with their concert series. That's every Friday night in June and July. Uh, we run the beer garden there, up a mountain, down a beer. That's a down a beer activity. Um, so we run the beer garden out there and all proceeds benefit up a down a woo. So come and enjoy beer and great music um, out at First in Maine again every Friday. Um, excuse me if I said first Friday, but it's every Friday in June and July from five to seven. Okay, looking at notes. Adventure on Tap is the next thing, and that is Thursday the 13th from six to eight, again in our building, um, in our shared building at the next desk, 525 North Cascade. And that is Eric Sprinkle. He is a phenomenal speaker, and he's gonna be discussing the formula for adventure. So the difference between going to an amusement park adventure and going whitewater rafting adventure and what the difference is and how that's better for your life to go outdoors and adventure. Um, I still like amusement parks too, but it's different. All right, Bristol Brewing has invited us to their 25th anniversary, go Bristol. And we're gonna be uh, joining them on Saturday the 15th from 12 to six and we're gonna do a cornhole tournament. So sign up for that. I'll have registration up shortly. Um, and you guys can grab a team and sign up for that. Saturday adventure. Notice I left out the third Saturday adventure. So we're kind of messing with the schedule a little bit. My staff um, has lots of events packed in one week. So what we're trying to do as a team is spread out those events more so that they land in a different week and not all in the same week. So the third Saturday adventure is now transforming to just Saturday adventure um, so that we could literally put it on any Saturday. Um, we might even cut it down just to be the adventure day um, because it might not even take place on a Saturday at, at one point. So that is coming up June 22nd now and it's from nine to 11, so we're shifting to our summer hours for our hikes because it's getting hotter. We wanna get you out of the sun sooner. So from nine to 11, June 22nd, Catamount Ranch open space. It's beautiful if you've never been there. It's amazing. So we'd love for you to go. Um, that's it for events. Hopefully I'm not forgetting anything. Huge shout out to our volunteers. We've had a lot of people step up recently to help me. Uh, we've had hired a lot of new staff, so shout out to them. Um, also shout out to Shane at Shibumi. He drove all the way from Carbondale in the snow and ice to give our paddleboard staff some training, so thank you to Shane. Um, and now I just blanked sponsors. Um, thank you to everybody for helping Up and Down and be as successful as it is. We really couldn't do this without you. I couldn't do this without you, so thank you so much. Um, as always, if you feel like you would like to donate to our organization, all that money would go back into our programs and hiring staff and making these things run for the public so that they remain free. Um, you can do that on our website, upadowna.org slash donate. And you can do that from Facebook somewhere. There's a button you can click donate. And then also on our Instagram page now. So thanks again. Have a great Friday and a great weekend and unleash your adventure.